Now, hey, 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 guys! Drunken minority here for stupidity, aka fan fiction. I haven't read a fanfic, a fanfic in the longest time. By Durgan. I'll tweet you when it's over. Anyway, fan fan fiction. Right. This this is stupid. <laughs> like all fan fictions are. I don't know what the oh it's called Arkham Sonic the Hedgehog and Batman Arkham Asylum crossover. What? Why? I should start reading. <laughs> and I'm bullcrapping, so let me start this music. That works. Drop my controller, whatever. Where's the remote control? That works. Anyway. Ahem. Chapter 1. Joker captured? Question mark. Sonic was running to Arkham Island to deliver the Joker back to the asylum for Batman was currently in Metropolis taking care of a threat he had gone for a few months. But Batman wasn't informed that Sonic was taking care of Gotham, so he had no idea. So Sonic is protecting Gotham temporarily. When he arrived at the asylum, he noticed it looked very old. No shit. When he entered with Joker, Joker was giggling the whole way when he caught sight of the warden. He said, hey Sharpie, I love what you've done with the place. That's Warden Sharp to you, Bowles. Bowls. Then a man with a scar over his left eye approached Joker. Yo, Frankie, how's the wife and kids? You miss me? Shut it, clown. A lot of people here want to talk to you. So basically, he's just retyping all the things that were said in the beginning of Arkham Asylum. Gotcha. Then he shoved Joker in the trolley to strap him to. Really, I don't mind walking. Hey, not so tight, boys. You increase their suit. Okay. I'm going to stop reading this because <laughs> it's blatantly plagiarizing Arkham Asylum. Sonic felt the urge something wasn't right and wanted to go with him because Sonic is now replacing Batman in this. Warden, something's not right. I'm going with him. And Sonic followed Sonic. Sonic the, Sonic the Duck. And Sonic followed Joker. And the Joker guards down to the deepest depths of Arkham Asylum. When they reached the bottom level, Joker finally... I wish my dear... Uh, old friend Batman were here to see this. Ha ha ha. Then Sonic saw Jim Gordon sign paperwork at the desk. Sonic walked up to him. Long night, Jim. Gordon stood up. Joker invaded City Hall and held the mayor hostage. Leaving it to the juggle me, the juggle SWAT teams, the media, and you. It's one one hell of a night, but what they didn't know was Harley Quinn was watching everything in the control room. No shit. When they reached the end of the hall, it was blocked by a guard and electric barrier. Hold it there. Sorry, Sonic. Often says only. Go and try to help the situation. I assure you, it's if anyone's quiet, it's he cut off. Thanks for the concern, but he may unsettle more of the violent guards. I think he's talking about you, Hedgehog. Don't be a stranger. You're always welcome here. Gotta say, it's good to be back. Ha ha. So more Arkham thing things up with Sonic added. <laughs> he basically just added Sonic to this fan fiction so he wouldn't get caught for plagiarism. Gordon saw the worried look on Sonic's face. You okay? He surrendered almost without a fight. I don't like it. At least he's back where he belongs. Then the guards was, ed was escorting Joker to his cell. Joker had something else in his mind. He fell to the ground. Get up now. Joker hit Buddy the guard. Strang him with the handcuffs. Sonic saw what's happening. Joker's loose. Alert the warden. So Joker was saying, Hurry, we're losing him, Doc. Ha 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 ha. Then he tossed the now dead guard away and jumped on him and whispered in. The joke's on you. Karen, honey, I'm home. Harley, Harley opened the door. Come on in. Lower the electric barrier, Sonic used homie attack to burst through the glass, but Joker already barricaded himself in electric field. Welcome to the madhouse, Sonic. I set track, and you sprang it gloriously. Now let's see, get the party started. You released several inmates. Oh great, Sonic said to himself. This, this shit is stupid, because it's just plagiar- It's just plagiarizing off of Arkham Asylum. 
but to make it not so plagiarized of Arkham Asylum, it has Sonic in it instead of a Batman, which is stupid. Sonic stood ready at Joker some several inmates in the eels. Ladies and maniacs, I apologize for interrupting your regular entertainment. Up to now, I was just going to kill everyone in the room and watch the cartoons, but now, but you do know how I love a live audience, captive audience, Joker said Joker. Sonic easily took down inmates with homing attacks. I'm warm I'm just warming up, hedgehog. Ding ding ding, it's round two. Said Joker, he seemed to notice inmates were losing, so he said, Gotta run, I've got places to go. Get off my screen, you bro. And people to slay as Joker left the control room and ran away when Sonic took down the last enemies. Gordon appeared in the monitor. The system jammed. We're stuck in here. Joker is in full control of the security gates. I'll find a way to call the warden and tell him what happened. Joker appeared on the monitor. Don't make promises you can't keep. I'm in control of this side. We're not going anywhere. I don't want you. Want you to. There is no Batman around here. To do saving only you, haha. Ha. Then Joker turned off the laser gate to let Sonic through. Sonic ran through as quick as he can, taking down inmates along the way. Then Tails contacted. God damn it! Tails is now Oracle. <laughs> He's replacing. <laughs> He's taking all of the Arkham Asyl Asylum people and just replacing them with Sonic characters. Then why the fuck it wasn't Joker just Eggman? <laughs> You need help. Well, I guess nobody likes Eggman enough to be Joker. I mean, Harley Quinn. Do you need help now? I. Oh, I've got Oracle here too. God damn it. Is my dad still here? Gordon is safe. Joker isn't far. Of course, because it wouldn't make sense for Tails to call Gordon his father. Joker has escaped and is running free in the asylum. Do you need any help? Blah. Go and save. Joker isn't far ahead. I'll be in touch. Then he entered another room and some guards were yelling. Think about what he's you're doing, Zaz. Sonic approached the guards. What's wrong? It's Zaz. He's got Mike. He's strapped into a chair. Zaz is totally lost it. I'll save him. Then Zaz said, I see anything that looks a bit like a bat or a hedgehog. <laughs> a bat or a hedgehog. It's... <laughs> then the guard dies. Do you hear me? Then... He electrocuted the guard. Sonic made his way to the stairs, avoiding being seen by Jan. Then he crawls across the room. Homing attack Zaz from behind. Someone put him back in his cell. Then the monitor came on, and another, none other than Harley Quinn appeared on it. Can you hear me? Is this thing going? Oh, hi, it's Sonic. Harley here. Harley Quinn here. How do you like my uniform? Pretty hot, huh? Oh, I have something to show you. One second. Ta da! As she showed Sonic, she had the warden tied up. I'm now subbing for the old man of Sharpie. He's never been happier. In case you haven't figured it out, today's the Joker's big homecoming. And you're the guest of Anna. Sonic had enough. You have one chance to give up, Harley. Tipping, tipping, Hedgehog, but no dice. Now the inmates are running the asylum. Well, technically, the Joker's goon slipped in the black gate, but you get the idea. Bye-bye for now. Then she smashed the camera broadcast and then broke the connection. Finally, continuing, just after a while. Okay. This is just... I, I'm going to have to title this Plagiarize Arkham Asylum featuring Sonic. <laughs> because that's all this is. Uh, Yosuke, help me. Son Chapter 3, Enhanced Inmates. Sonic, are you there? Arkham just vanished off the network, and Joker is saying he's put bombs all over Gotham. Says he'll detonate them if anyone sets foot on Arkham Asylum. Tails, it can only be a trick because he likes to get around. Alright, I'll keep that in mind. Then Sonic realized Harley locked all the doors, trapping him inside. But he found an air vent and escaped through it. He came through the other side where a guard was panicking from the next room. And Joker filled it with happy gas, causing the guards to laugh until death. Laugh until death? What is this stuff? said the guard. It must be Joker laughing gas. Are you going to help them, Sonic? Sonic immediately went into the room. He saw a guard hanging from ledge. He saved him before he let go. He then picked up a piece of metal and threw it at the control box, getting rid of the gas, because Sonic doesn't have batter ranks. <laughs> Until he did, he heard Joker laughing hysterically. Then Sonic entered the next room and saw the whole room was painted by Joker. High was written on the walls and smiles. Then Joker spoke through the loudspeaker. What are you waiting for? Then Sonic followed the trail of arrows left 
Joker left behind. The arrows led him into the stream isolation chamber, and he... What? And Joker was waiting. What took so long? You can't escape, Joker. I'll find you wherever you go. Oh, I'm counting on it, just not yet. Then he opened a giant vault-like thing, and his beast emerged from it. He's a big one, ha ha ha. Then the beast tried to charge into Sonic. Sonic used homing attack on him and made it dizzy and crashed into a wall. Then the beast held his heart and collapsed dead. Joker got angry look on his face. This was unexpected, wasn't it? Note to self. Need stronger test subjects. Seeing as how I'm feeling, Jeff, I'll give you this one for three. Knock me off, I dare you. You end this. Hold the plug. Do something bats never could do. Stop me once and for all. Sonic refused to. Joker just laughed. You pre you are pathetically predictable. I've got more surprises on the way. You'll see me. He he he. As the platform he was on moved behind the door and sealed, Sonic saw a guard in the booth. He called Sonic to come. It was Steve and J. Blum. He's told Sonic about where the Joker had gone. We call it extreme isolation. The only way in is via transport system. As the guard went to open the door, Sonic appeared on the screen. I'm sorry, Joker. Having a little trouble up there? You can't escape, you know. Silly hedgehog. I don't want to escape. I'm having too much fun. I may not have the bat, but at least I have you here to keep a smile on my face. Oh, I forgot to say, just in case you're planning on following me, I've arranged a little insurance. As he turned the camera to the security monitor, showing Gordon and Frank Bowles. It showed Bowles hitting Gordon in the back of the head with a stick, knocking him out. Gordon is on his way to Harley as we speak. Officer Bowles, Joker laughed at the sight. If I see you trying to follow me, he dies. Harley looked forward, forward to make it. I'll film it and post it on the internet. He 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 he. Then Sonic decided to go save Gordon before going after Joker. <sighs> Plagiarism. Sonic Arkham Asylum. God damn it, this thing is stupid as shit. <sighs> going after Gordon. Sonic ex exited the isolation room and as soon as he did, Oracle contacted him. Sonic, what's happening? Joker escaped. He sealed himself off. He's got your dad. Gasp! Dad! Don't worry, I'll save him. I won't let Joker win. As he ran through... Th this is just... Fucking... This is just so he can plagiarize Arkham Asylum. <laughs> By just adding Sonic the Hedgehog and Tail to it. To make it so it's not so plagiarized. <laughs> this is the stupidest fan fiction ever. I'm afraid I'm going to get copyright strikes for <laughs> for posting it on YouTube. As he ran through the hall and saw other inmates that just killed two guards. Did you see how many teeth came out? Said the inmate. Sonic was disgust disgusted at them, so he homing attacked one of them. Hey, this will be easy, Hedgehog. <sighs> Sonic easily took them down him down as he approached the room where Gordon was taken he wasn't there anymore but he noticed muddy footprints of going along the opposite way Sonic knew it was his best bet to follow him he followed the tracks to the elevator shaft because Sonic doesn't have detective vision so he had to make something else new so it wouldn't be plagiarism muddy footprints uh 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 Hedgehog, Mr. J doesn't want you following him us just yet. Then she took out the detonator from her pocket and blew up the elevator, causing it to crash to the bottom of the floor. Son almost, Sonic almost got hit. Harley used the wire to get back up. She yelled through the top floor, how'd you like that? No way, you're following us now. You're trapped down there till me and Mr. J are ready for you. Ha ha ha. Sonic knew that he could get up anyway by just jumping from platform to platform because he can't fly. As he was doing that, son, Joker's voice echoed through the room. Hey, Hedgehog, I know you can hear me. I got a little something for you to listen to. Harley and Frank were nearly out of the building with an old man. How are you going to get past all those guards? Let's take ignition, shall we? Ignition? I, I... Uh, da, 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 da. Da 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 Hey, Frank, where you been? Joker's got his... Crew coming through the door over in there. Hurry, damn it, hurry. How many are there, Bowles? How the hell do you know? He was cut off because Bowles shot him down. Bowles, Frank, what are you doing? No, put it down. Gunshot. Frank, what the hell? Boom. Gunshot, I'm sorry. Quinn is it's clear. Get your ass in here. 
You're some piece of work, Frankie. A girl could fall for someone like you. Joker's angry voice said, Stop flirting with the hired help, Harley. Don't worry, sweetie. You know I only have eye for you. Did you hear that, Hedgehog? Looks like Frankie's working out just fine. Another valuable employee for the organization. Sonic listened to the mass murder Frank just committed. It was horrible. It was horrible. Sonic finally made it to the top of the elevator shaft. Then Tails called him. How's it going down there? Harley tried to slow me down. She dropped the elevator on me. Are you okay? Yes. I'll call you an oracle once I find Gordon. Then he crawled into another air vent and saw some guards being shot by inmates. Sonic got out. He asked Tails for help. Tails and inmates have guns. That's not good. Try going across the ceiling to avoid them. Sonic did so and was able to take them out. <sighs> and he saw footprints again. Followed them until the next room. And came up. Came up some stairs and saw a body of Frank Bowles. Joker must have figured out how I was tracking Gordon. Frank Bowles trail ends here. Then William North came through the door and called Sonic. Hey Sonic, over here. Because, you know, Riddler. Because Sonic isn't smart enough to have riddle puzzles. Oh no! Hey Sonic, over here. Sonic approached him and talked to him. It was a nightmare. Bowles came through telling everyone to cover their main interest. Two of my guys moved to the exit and Frank shot him dead. I had no choice. I came in. I came in here, locked the door. I saw the whole thing on my security monitor. Harley was with the commissioner. Bowles is dead. They decided to go without him. Good. That scum then. Sonic went out the exit and followed Harley because she took him outside. No shit. Because this is all plagiarized. What? <laughs> what? This chapter is making me sad now. Ugh. Sonic went outside to follow Gordon. He thought that this was a worst night ever already. He went through the door until he was outside. He saw the Arkham Mansion and saw it and a guard named Louis Green. He stopped him. Hey Sonic, Sonic stop. What is it? I found something. Come here. He took Sonic down to a small building and pointed at a small dog-like creature. Fast asleep with a piece of chocolate in his hand. Sonic, I found this guy unconscious on the ground when I came out here. I picked him up when I he woke up. He panicked because he didn't he doesn't remember his name or any god damn it. So now they're mixing in Sonic Unleashed into this plagiarism of, of Arkham Asylum. God damn it. I've diagnosed him with amnesia, but he panicked. I offered him some chocolate. He seemed to enjoy it very much. He ate a lot and fell asleep. Really, so how is he does not remember anything? No, he hasn't. Well, can he come with me? I'm sure I can help him with his get his memory back. Alright, I'll let you take him, but be careful. I also notice he gets scared of certain things. The dog-like creature woke up. Oh, hello, said the dog as he began to continue eating his chocolate. Louis told him that Sonic would help him get his memory back. The dog turned to face Sonic. Oh, thank you. No problem, but I need help. This asylum has been taken over by a man called Joker, so I'll help you. Will you join me? Yes. Want some chocolate? Sonic politely accepted. I'm going to call you... What am I going to call you since I can't? You can't remember who you are. How about Chip? What do you think? Yes, Chip. Chip, I love it. Yum. Okay, let's go. And that's five chapters of this bullshit.